This is the Doctor continuing the Battle Brothers Gladiators playthrough. In the last video, we fought by far the hardest battle in the campaign, even over that a Barbarian King battle. Uh, we have very strong brothers, but those five Linworms with their improved AI and the better zone of control on tail, uh, yeah, that was hard. Uh, I haven't... You, I think to do Lindworm safely, you basically need nets to control their positioning. Like, if you can't control their positioning, it's going to be a disaster. So if I come across five, five more Lindworms, I can't fight them. I only have one net left. Uh, I just, it, it'd be suicidal. Um, if there's three Lindworms, sure. Just sending three tanks, no problem. I will say, the um, my Battleforge tank, I think, proved his value. There is, um, I'm sure there were a lot of uh, eye rolling when I first uh, made this guy into a tank with his puny melee defense. Like, shouldn't it be over 40? Well, Iron Lungs Determined adds a tremendous amount of value. Being able to sit there and permanently shield wall is super, super strong, um, as we could see in that Lindworm fight. And I think, uh, now, this Beast Slayer, he didn't really do too much, but he tanked a little bit. I think we're going to prove that this guy has value as well in future battles. Uh, let's do some level ups here. More fatigue. Rixus leveled up. Good job, buddy. You definitely need some more fatigue. My Lumberjack leveled up. Hmm, a little more, um, you don't need too much more of anything, really. I'm actually going to start upping your melee skill so that you can lock certain enemies down. Your fatigue seems great, despite the super heavy equipment you're wearing. Can't hurt to have more resolve. You have 82, though. That's so good already. But, let's, I mean, nothing else makes sense. All right, my duelist leveled up. Oh my gosh, yes, plus three, beautiful. Uh, I do need some more fatigue now. Um, we don't have to give you the duelist ability yet. We can wait. Um, Alicia leveled up, good. Can't pass up another plus five resolve roll or your fearsome build. Hmm, the wild man leveled up, plus three, good. Good. Don't care about that. All right, you you can wear heavy armor. You may not even need brawny. You are going to go fearsome with the war scythe, and I like Pathfinder a lot. Does anything else make sense here? Pathfinder works so well with poor arm mastery. You don't need brawny. You're a uh, you, you're going to have plenty of fatigue. Bags and belts could have some value. You know, we don't have to assign the perk point yet. Let's see how well you do without Pathfinder. Alright, let's uh, explore a bit. What we need are some nets. Because <laughs> if we want to fight more Linworms, we're going to have to have nets. Uh, fortunately, we are in Goblin territory. So let's go north, see if we can kill some goblins. Goblins have nets. And then, I guess we can swing around back south, try to pick up some more contracts, just to see what sort of variety these towns have. And then we'll head north to Krakenland. We need nets. So we really need to find some gobbles to kill. Gobbles have nets. Or beast. I wouldn't mind fighting more beasts right now. Okay, I mean, this is not goblins, but uh, it's something to kill. But it's easy, right? Few auxiliary, many legionnaires. I've beaten that before, so I'm not going to record this. Simple fight. We took a small amount of damage, but 28 tools. That's real good. We need the tools. Um, let's see. Oh, that reminds me. I want to look at my retinue again. A little damaged. Because I have one more slot now. Oh, I should have hired someone. So the drill sergeant's not doing much for us right now. We have mostly level 11 guys. 
Mm, I'm. And uh, some of my other characters, like this Novo, he's getting a tiny benefit. Yeah, I only have four people I'm leveling up. So the Drill Sergeant's really not doing much right now. We need to get rid of him. Um, I'm thinking we might as well get the Scavenger. Like, first of all, we only have so many choices right now, right? Uh, seven of them. We can't even use the rest of these. So we have to look at the seven, right? Negotiator's useless. We're not doing contracts. Recruiter's useless. We're not recruiting. Surgeon is useful. It's kind of a guarantee survival is strong, but we're uh, out gearing most things right now. The trader is useless. We're not doing that. So the surgeon's a possibility. The scavenger, more tools. That's not bad. And then the alchemist is good with crafting, but we're not crafting right now. So my th feeling is we hire a cartographer. He might make back his money. Ooh. Like, I don't really care about the, the money, but, you know, you, you might make us a few thousand crowns. Like, no one else even makes sense. Hire you. And then the drill sergeant just is not doing enough right now. Let's replace you with the scavenger. All right. I should have done that earlier so that we could have gotten some money from that uh, battle site, that ancient dead camp. But what are you going to do, right? What are these? Gobbles. Yes, yes. We want to fight the gobbles. Where are the gobbles? Hmm. Interesting. This location has fortifications, huh? Yeah, I'll fight gobbles. I wonder what the AI is going to do. Let me reorganize my company. All right, they have fortifications. I'm guessing they're going to stay behind their fortifications, pelt me with arrows. As I get close, they're going to net me and do all sorts of shenanigans. Could be a problem. But there aren't that many of them. This might still be a very tough fight because I haven't fought gobbles uh, recently. So I swapped out the butcher's armor uh, because the hyena one needs repairing. Ganicus has the quick hand shenanigans. That should help a lot. The uh, bone plating is not doing much. We need another hyena pelt for you because you might actually move ahead of the goblins. So we need to find some other armor. I'm just like, I want famed armor above all else here. I might need Berserk Killing Frenzy. We'll see. Or I might not. Let's, uh, let's just attack this camp. How many are there? 16. Ooh. That is uh, slightly concerning. I'm about to forge. Ooh. Hey, how did he uh, poison my gravedigger? Did they have better armor penetration? I mean, that's not super heavy armor. It's only battle forge armor, but still. I mean, it's only 200 armor, but still. How did they. Uh... This is a lot. Let's uh, move Ganicus up a little bit. I don't want them to... Yep. Oh, okay. One of them's moving out. Interesting. Spread out so we don't get mass rooted. Hmm. I have to th think about this. Let's not break anyone out yet. Well, the Beast Slayer can uh, re ally. Fix this. Good. That's where the shaman is. Kind uh, of vulnerable to getting AoE down. I want to see what these skirmishers do. You can still uh, take a hit or two from those arrows. Just wait. 
Lumberjack's a little worried. The dagger guys are still kind of dangerous. Let's see what they do. Okay. Anakis is fast. Get netted here and then pelted with arrows. Uh, but I think we have to put some pressure on these. I think we just have to. Uh, the way you beat goblins is you gotta be super aggressive. Especially when they have no overseer. This is good because we can break them. This guy's got a dagger. He's scary. We can adrenaline. Oh, I should have moved here and then adrenaline with uh, Spartacus. Hmm. These guys have daggers. I do not want to put my Battleforge characters next. Like that. Seems crazy. This? I'm gonna stay back. Let's... They might focus fire my gunner. Now that I think about it. <laughs> Getting on the high ground seems good. Alright, Yannickus can go first. Damn, I was really hoping for that to kill. It's fine. My uh, lumberjack can take it. That's fine, my super heavy armor is not afraid of your puny arrows. Yeah, I was afraid of that. Okay, you pass your turn. Thank you, buddy. Good. Oh, I'm not going to get any nuts out of this battle, am I? It's going to be a lot harder to get nuts now. It's disappointing. Alright, let's see. What are, this one's going to run up or do something that I don't really care about. Going to nut Crixes, probably. I don't see that I can go ahead of them. Go here and then lunge. I'm not gonna be able to get the net. Breaking through the front has a lot of value. Let's just wait. We're gonna have to let them net us. I don't see a way around that. Might be able to get this guy's net. That's fine. That's less fine. gonna run. Are all their turns done? Yes. Forty-six percent. Hmm. Damn. They are uh, accurate little buggers, aren't they? Hmm. 
wait. Good, that's what I was looking for. Free uh, ally. Free ally. I'm rolling a lot of these, uh, I have good rows on these uh, free chances. Which is amazing. This guy's turn done. Nope. Let's wait. I want to see what they do. I could adrenaline. I think there's a lot of valuing there. So we're going to wait. A little afraid of that, but that's okay. Ah, interesting. Definitely adrenaline in here. What? Two fearsome procs and I didn't break that little bastard. Really? Let's uh, protect the gunner. Any other shenanigans I can do? Not really. I could have moved here, try to kill you. Let's, uh, this? Alright. Your adrenaline, you're gonna adrenaline. Hopefully, I get your net. Good, we got at least one net out of this. That's worth it. One of the ambushers has broken. We've got a lot more archers, but their front line has completely collapsed. And now they're going to pelt us with some more arrows at 5%, which is fine. Dagger, we'll wait. Ow. They're definitely a lot more, or not a lot more annoying. They're about the same amount of annoying as they used to be. Or maybe not the same, but they're a little more annoying. But they're not that bad, honestly. 80%, 88, 88 seems pretty good. We have Relentless, we might as well wait for Crixus to come in, get a little more accuracy. Same deal here. Same deal here. Yeah, we gotta pin you down, make sure you don't rally. Watch out for that, um... You gotta watch out for their, um... Uh, whatchamacallit, um... Uh, daggers! Good job. Marcus, adrenaline, you can double attack. Right? If we adrenaline now... Um, you go up to 61. That's enough for two attacks. That's worth it. Unless I counted that wrong. Just definitely possible. Alright. 93 seems pretty good. Rixus is not afraid. Uh, 
They seem to love shooting back there, so... Stay put. Yeah, I could have attacked twice, but... All right, are they running? Not complaining if they are. This one could break. Quick can shenanigans. That works. That works. Good job, Ganicus. They should uh, be panicking and running now. Yep. I think I want to unleash some dogs to hunt them down. I hate these things. There we go. All right, but I don't need to record hunting down the gobbles. That was a fun little fight. I like the uh, fortifications on the goblins. It adds a little bit of extra challenge. Ooh, look at this. Captain's reinforced mail. That was nice. Ooh, gobble poison. I love that stuff. Shaman's thing. Um, what are these bows? 30 to 50. Seems pretty garbage. I don't need the rest of this stuff. Um, might as well take some strange meat. All right, we found a fame armor. I I took it right. Okay, good. I just want to make sure I didn't ditch the fame armor. Fame armor, very good. These weapons are hardly even worth much. All right. Cool. A thirteen fatigue fame armor. This is basically a better noble mail. Uh, so certainly a good find. Who would benefit from it? I feel like Ganicus could benefit. The question is, do we attach the bone plating or the hyena pelt? Hmm. It depends on the type of enemy I'm fighting, right? We already have a bone plating attached one. This is almost perfect nimble. Uh, let's attach another hyena pelt. You have 140 initiative. That's pretty good. You can always uh, swap out armors as necessary, right? So, yeah. That was fun. I like that little goblin fight there. Rixus is fine. All right, let's uh, keep going. Uh, which way should we go now? I kind of like goblin territory. Let's keep going east. The further you are from civilization, the more likely you're going to find uh, famed items. I do not care about six goblin ambushers. Ooh. Sea of Tents. We're in orc territory now. Huh, I thought this was orc territory. Goblin and orc territory must be mixed up. Well, we have to go fight this, of course. And warlord, some warriors, some young. Uh, let me reorganize the company. All right. Well, I think it's uh, time to do the Sea of Tents, but I'll do it in the next video since the battle might take a little bit. So thank you for watching. Until next time.